In question 17, we are given some information about the conversion rates between pounds and euros. And the question says, Robert has £600 and he wishes to change it into euros. The problem with our table is it doesn't go all the way down to 600 but it doesn't matter because we can use some of the information here to work out what £600 would be in euros. Now, there's many, many ways you can do this, but the easiest way probably is to use 100. So, I'm just going to write something down here. So, if £100 is for, sorry, 120 euros, you should be able to see if you times this by 6, you actually get to £600. So all we have to do is times 120 euros also by 6. And that would give us 720 euros. So you're trying to find a number in here that you can multiply or do things with it to actually make it equal that 600. So for two marks, you just needed to write 720 euros. I'm going to do part B in a different video.